My name is Angelina Lovalente. I am a women's fitness coach and competitive bodybuilder. So it is important for me to lead by example and really be an influence in the health and wellness industry. So I've always been very cognizant about treating my body well and optimizing my health. So that is why I found Titan Medical to really help take my health and wellness to the next level. You know, I have always been really in tune with my body, making sure that my cognitive function is well, um, that my digestion is good, that my energy is up. So I was pretty happy with where I was, but as a competitive bodybuilder, knowing that I wanted to take things to the next level and really have that competitive edge. So once I started taking the Titan Medical Therapies, I mean, it just took me to another level. Um, my energy not only was steady, but sustained through the day. I was able to perform better at work, in the gym, uh, had better endurance. As we know, you know, every day counts when you're a competitor. So being able to push hard and really make the most of the day was really important. Sure, so I take the ECA stack in the morning. It is ephedrine, caffeine, aspirin, uh, B12, and chromium as well. So that has just completely elevated my energy levels. Um, more so than a cup of coffee or a tea in the morning that just gives you that little burst. This is really sustained energy throughout the day. This has allowed me to be more present at work. This has given me the energy to get through my day and still be able to push hard in the gym at the end of the day. Um, I've also been taking the Hercules potion, which is a blend of amino acids, um, as well as glutamine and some recovery agents. So that is um, a targeted intramuscular injection. So whether you're doing glutes, you're doing shoulders, um, you can be really specific with getting a good pump in that certain area. So I remember my first week taking the potion <laughs> and I don't think I had ever been more sore in my life and that really just enabled me to understand that you know I had maybe been selling myself short in the gym and really had more to give so every time I've used the potion I've had an incredible workout and really had enhanced recovery on top of that so it's allowed me to perform at my best I feel like a new person <laughs> honestly I was always really happy with my energy levels and was performing better than average in the gym but now that I have my Titan therapies, I know that I am maximizing every single day. I'm being able to show up better in my work, in my relationships, in the gym, and it's just overall enhanced everything that I do. Oh, it was incredible. So I actually had my consultation right from my bedroom in my pajamas, which was extremely convenient. Uh, the doctor took me through all of the Titan therapies, so I was knowledgeable on each of them, what it included, what was really gonna help support my goals, um, and then customize all the therapies for me specifically. Um, no question went unanswered, and once my consultation was finished, the team followed up immediately, was able to put in my therapies, and they arrived at my door in two days. I couldn't be happier as a Titan patient. Honestly, I feel great, but on top of that, the Titan family has been extremely supportive. Um, everybody is really performing at their best and is extremely supportive, so I'm happy to be a part of the team.
Hi, I'm Rodney. I'm 51 years old. I've been with Titan Medical for going on eight years now, and uh, I love it, and it's definitely the fountain of youth. I decided to become a Titan patient because uh, I just wanted results. I wanted to be healthier. I wanted to look better. I wanted to feel better. I wanted to function better, and I knew that joining Titan Medical would definitely lead me in the right direction. Before Titan Medical, I was very lethargic, not much energy, not much focus, and now that's all changed now. After getting my blood work done with Titan Medical, I definitely noticed that my levels were off and they definitely got me back in line, got my hormones back on track and uh, my life has definitely changed since then. The Titan Medical Therapist that I use is the Titan Hercules Potion, the Titan Complete and the Titan ECA Stack. All of them are definitely game changers and uh, I definitely got to keep using them every day. Since joining Titan Medical, I feel amazing. People don't believe my age, they don't believe how I look. and. Uh, I feel wonderful, tons of energy, tons of stamina, and everything is through the roof. I love Titan Medical. My experience with Titan Medical staff, the doctors, the nurses, everyone has been nothing but amazing. Everybody is very knowledgeable, helpful, and it will definitely lead you in the right direction. And uh, they are just amazing people to work with. Being a Titan Medical patient has been very wonderful for me. It's helped my life amazingly. and. Uh, I thank John and Sharice for bringing me aboard. It's been a long journey and uh, they've definitely changed my life, a game changer, and I'm so grateful for them. What's up guys, John here from Titan, and today I want to talk about something that gets brought up a lot by male patients in particular, and that is erectile dysfunction. So erectile dysfunction is a very common thing. A lot of people don't want to talk about it, right? They're, they're either embarrassed, their ego, whatever it may be, they might feel less of a man, so they don't they just don't want to talk about it. They don't want to talk about it with their partner, they don't want to talk about it with a medical provider, you know, they're in denial in some circumstances. Um, they just don't want to hear it or, or feel about it or even care. So let's talk about erectile dysfunction. So erectile dysfunction, it affects over 30 million guys in the United States. Maybe more because that's just the people that are talking about it, okay? The second thing is, is it's not a part of aging. So it doesn't matter how old you are. Now, the research does show that if you're over 40, you're at a higher risk of having erectile dysfunction. But that's not because of aging. It's usually because of health issues. And that's one of the main things that causes erectile dysfunction. So poor circulation, blood flow, that, that's affecting your erections. That's one of the biggest ones. Now being obese, this is another high risk category for erectile dysfunction. You know, being obese over 25 on your BMI in particular, you're at a very, very high risk for erectile dysfunction. Now there's other things that affect erections. Okay, so let's talk about some of those different ones like alcohol, drugs, okay, stress, anxiety, high cholesterol, diabetes, heart disease, smoking, all these different things. And there's a lot more, okay? There's just some of the different ones I want to name because those are the most common things that people deal with every day or are, are doing, okay? And when you're doing these different things or have these different issues going on, this is not only going to affect your health, but as guys, it's going to affect our erections. And this can affect us in a lot of different ways in our life. And by having erectile dysfunction, it can cause issues with your self-confidence. It can cause issues with your partner per se, because you're not performing, they want to know why, what's going on, what's the problem, is it me? That's, you know, that's what the wife and girlfriend usually say. You know, at that point, you might feel even more embarrassed. You're like, man, what do I do about this? Like, I just don't know what to do. I don't know why this is happening to me. 
So when you look at the different things that you're doing in your lifestyle, or do you have some of these different health conditions? And if you do have some of these different health conditions, like I named, you know, talk to your medical provider. You know, talk to somebody that can actually help you with amino enhancement because it's a part of, of li your life, right? The quality of life is to have good sexual function for yourself, for your partner. You want to make sure that you're good to go, okay? So when we talk about different medications, I'm not talking about drugs, I'm talking about illicit drugs, I'm talking about medications like for depression. These different medications can cause erectile dysfunction. It's not your fault. You may have serious depression and you may need these medications so you feel all right, okay? So if you have to take these depression medications or antidepressants, then at that point, you need to talk to your medical provider about possible libido enhancement. Something that's gonna help you, you know, have erections and be confident in the bedroom. Now, sometimes it really doesn't come down to erectile dysfunction physically, but some people have erectile dysfunction mentally, okay? And it might be an insecurity or something that happened to them previously in their life some sort of stressful event that can cause problems in the bedroom, that's not your fault either. Now, if you guys are just tired of your partner or you're angry at your partner and that's one thing, that's a whole different story. If there was something that happened in the past that could be mentally blocking you to having good sexual function, you may need a libido enhancer. So don't be ashamed. That's the big point out there. There's people out there that can help you guys. At Titan Medical Center, we can help you guys. We have all different powerful combinations, you know, for all different types of people. No matter what your your status is or what your health status is, we can help you guys. So we can improve your quality of life because you want your partner feeling good, you want to feel good, and you want that self confidence there, right? So we can help you guys, and we can provide that. So if you guys are looking for libido enhancement, if you guys think you have erectile dysfunction and you want to talk to somebody, then you guys should call or text us at Titan. The number is 727-389-3220. Hey guys, John here from Titan, and I want to let you guys know about the Titan Medical Lifestyle Podcast. You can hear us all over the world, anytime you want, right at your fingertips, whether it's on your cell phone, your tablet, or your desktop, okay? You guys can find our podcast wherever podcasts are at, whether it's Google Play, Apple, iHeartRadio, Pandora, Spotify, you can tune in and listen to us. And we talk about a number of different topics that you guys are going to love, from medical science to fitness to lifestyle, fashion, guy stuff, girl stuff, and a lot, lot more. So guys, tune into our podcast every week. We're updating it for you guys. Also, make sure you tune into our social media, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Snapchat. Don't forget YouTube, guys, for all those great videos the Tight Medical Center has. I appreciate you guys. Thank you, guys. And if you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to contact us at 727-389-3220. Make sure you guys also check out www.titanmedicalcenter.com. I'm John from Titan. Thanks a lot. What's up guys, John here. I'm Sharice. And we are back with another Cupid's Corner. Awesome, good information that you guys can utilize. Honestly, whatever doesn't break you will make you stronger. Sure. That is the truth. Every week, if you don't know, we come up with these tips and tricks to help you guys enhance your relationships. I hope they all see this episode. Whether it's reigniting that passion or just developing a better, stronger relationship. We went through a lot of these trials and tribulations, so we wanted to give you guys the shortcut I mean, you guys might even do this and not realize it, and your partner might be currently upset at you. So we might help you in that aspect. This is true. <laughs> so we're going to... What's up, guys? I'm John. I'm Sharice. And we're back with another Cupid's Corner, uh, bringing all kinds of good tips, tricks, and things that are going to help your relationship go to the next level. And if you're not in a relationship, you can, you know, take some of these tips and tricks, keep them to the side, so when you do find that right person... And you can utilize these tips and tricks to make your relationship the best possible one you can. Yes. Um, so this week, it's a little personal, but at that point, I want to share these tips with you. So vacations. Right. You know, vacations, everybody should take one 
once in a while anyway, right? Um, there's never a really right time, but, you know, try to plan for a good time to do it. The summer. Um, yeah. <laughs> so with Therese and her just turning 35. He's totally lying. I'm really just 25. There you go, 25. Yeah, yeah that's 25. better for me too. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, so for her birthday, you know, we usually go out. And we usually do a little vacation, a little trip anyway, right? Whether it's a couple days or whatever it is, we'll take what we can get, right? Yeah. So <laughs> at that point, you know, we want to go somewhere so we can go relax, revitalize, rejuvenate, you know, kind of recharge the battery so we can come back fresh. And obviously, Sharice wanted a little bit of time alone. She yeah. always likes to do that for her birthday. Uh, well, yeah, I don't, I'm not the one that likes, you know, he likes to have the big shebang with everybody around. Me personally, I like to be alone with maybe like, you know, if I am going to have a couple people around, we're like talking a max of 10. I don't want any more than 10 people and just everyone kind of just leave me alone for my birthday. I've always kind of been that way. But, you know, it's I figured it was a good way to just, you know, we had all of our best friends under one roof, which was very, very, very cool. Most of them. Most of them. Almost, yeah, we're missing almost. a couple. We're missing couple, a couple, couple stragglers. stragglers. Always. Every time. <laughs> and then, um, you know, obviously, you know, me and him have some, you know, a little alone time, which is nice. You know, because we, we're always working, you know, yeah. we're always working and then we're not working. We go home and then Peter's at home. And then we're, I mean, obviously have dinner with Peter, you know, do this with that. Get up the next day, do it all over again. And just kind of just the cycle of just bup, 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 you just forget to stop for a moment and like enjoy each other exactly. and enjoy the moment. Yep. We, we went to Cabo and it was, yeah. it was so, so nice. I really, really needed it. Yeah. I actually, the first time in nine years that I didn't open my laptop for two days. And I know two days seems like that's not really like that much, but in my world, two days is probably about two weeks in your world. Yeah. So it was a long time and I, I took everything out of me not to open the laptop. I'm like, ah, I need to do it. But you know, it, it was nice to just kind of, you know, decompress compress and disconnect for a little bit i think it's important for mental health you know emotional health just it just you need it i really do think you need it and i think the big point to this because obviously we're talking about cubits corner and relationships so i think relationships will really benefit from this because it's time that you guys should be taking away for each other right and you guys spend as much time as possible together and have fun. Mm -hmm. You guys are making good memories. There should be no negative information, influences, nothing around you that's going to disturb your time. Right. You guys are spending time and quality time together, right? So if you guys are on vacation, try to disconnect from the phone. Mm -hmm. Try to disconnect from the computer, right? We all know everybody has to work. We know better than anybody else, okay? <laughs> and, you know, whether it's in the office or social media or whatever we're doing, we have to do it. But, you know, you want to take that time away and really just get away. And that can reignite relationships, too. So mm -hmm. let's say you guys' relationship isn't that good or things just aren't you know, clicking the way they used to be. Yeah. You guys might need that, you know, alone time to really grow together again, you know. Make sure those roots aren't broken. Put them back together, right? Spend that time in the bedroom. Yep. Nobody's there. It's yeah. just you guys. Yeah. So if you guys have family, you guys know what that's all about. Even if you have yeah. dogs and stuff like I mean, that. The dogs aren't that bad because you can kick them off the bed, right? Because <laughs> I do that often, you know. But, you know, if you have, you know, the kids are outside playing with the dog by the door. And, you know, and, you know, maybe there's like, you know, your family member, John's daddy lives with us. I bless his heart for doing all the laundry for Peter. Thank you. Um, it's one less thing for me to do. But, you know, the laundry thing he's right outside our door True. so you know it's it's you gotta kind of it just kind of disturbs things a little bit so to so get away and you know we had the whole floor to ourselves, yeah. which was super awesome all i wanted to do and not for any specific reason i just wanted to scream just because i felt like i had the whole floor to myself and i could just scream as loud as i want nobody ever told me no and stop or anything because we're you know, we're on this huge yeah. you know we had this huge house that had like six floors and we all of our you know we went we went on this house with all our friends so it was a lot of fun you know one tip i can give you guys that on this trip thing right 
So let's just say you do decide to go with a group of friends, right? And we're talking about the relationship thing. So obviously you have to be able to allocate the different time frames for like, you know, this is going to be our time, you know, whether it's in the bedroom right. or we're going to cuddle and snuggle and watch a movie or whatever it might be. And then we'll have this time for our friends or for your friends. It's, it's not like, you know, it's he had his best friend out there. Mm. So the last thing I'd want is, you know, okay, him and his best friend are playing pool until four o'clock in the morning because there was a pool table there and they and he loves playing pool yeah. um but you know until four o'clock in the morning and i'm sitting there staring at them that'd be terrible right so it's you know you got to use some of your common sense you know when it comes to things like this and kind of have a happy balance or just just go by yourself go by yourself go by yourself that really is that that really is the key because go you don't have yourselves. to worry about entertaining people yep you don't have to worry about a schedule uh, I mean, that's, that's kind of where it is. Now, some people are different. They go on vacation. They have a very structured thing. They want to see all these different things, uh, you know, sightsee, this, that, whatever. That's fine if that's what you guys like to do. But listen, if you guys are going on vacation and that's not really a big thing to you guys, don't have a schedule. Yeah. Sleep I in, enjoy, revitalize, yeah. recharge the batteries. Because then you're always like, you know, then you're like, oh, we got to get here. Hurry, yeah, hurry, hurry, yeah. hurry, hurry. I mean, trust me, we have enough that day to day. Yeah. You know, our, our little inside, you know, joke to me and Sharice <laughs> every day. Rush, 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 Because literally, it's rush, 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 Everything we're doing, rush, 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 go, 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 Rush, 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 rush. So... This is time for you guys to, you know, take it back a notch and not rush, rush, rush. It was just like, it was like, rush, yeah. rush. It was still, you know, I still felt it, but it wasn't like, rush, 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 yeah. all day. Like this, like the Tasmanian devil. Yep. <laughs> just spinning. All day. Just spinning. <laughs> yeah. You don't want to do that. Um, you know, the best thing, is your, your mantra should be enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Yes. Enjoy the place you're at. Enjoy the company you're with, right? Mm -hmm. Enjoy the food or entertainment that's around you. That's another big thing. When you go on vacation, you know, you don't have to eat garbage. You don't have to eat like crap. Now, listen, if you want to splurge a little bit, that's cool. That's mm -hmm. fine. But, you know, don't get off track of what you're doing daily, your routine. I mean, some people, you know, they want to work out on vacation. Some people are like, I want to take a break. That's cool too. Just, you know, whatever, you know, floats your boat. Exactly. You know, whatever you feel comfortable with and that you want to do, what makes you happy? Right. Right? Because you're breaking away from work or whatever it is. You're with your partner. What's going to make you guys happy? You guys too. You know, yeah, just not, not just one, one or the other. Or right? the other. You know, like I'm going to just do this and, you know, you can do this. It's, yeah. The whole point is for you guys to get away together. Right. You know, maybe couples massages. That's right. a good one. Couples maybe good. a bath together. If you got a big enough bathtub, that's, that's a, good a good one. Maybe a shower together. Because, right. I mean, who, t who a takes a shower anymore? Me and John can barely fit in our own shower together. <laughs> if I'm in there, I'm like this for like, you know, like okay we're done I've had a minute of this I, I, I'm cold I don't have any of the water <laughs> we had this shower there and this shower was so cool I've never like the shower was amazing listen the whole bathroom was awesome and yeah. you know the little things in life that like yeah. makes me be like woohoo you know I'm all excited about these things but it had the the shower heads and there was like six shower heads on each side yep. and I'm like and one big one at the top one rain shower on one side and then another one that was larger so and either way you look shower, at it one. right we were able to take a shower together and no one was cold yeah I still had water on me at some point in time <laughs> and I wasn't freezing to death like yeah. eee. <laughs> you know so yeah exactly we didn't have hot water first Ooh. night that was fun um, but yeah outside of that you know it was it was nice but that's just you know a couple little things that you can do you know, together that it's, 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 you guys can connect Absolutely. like that, you Go know, enjoy lay by the pool, you know, together to talk about things like, you know, just break things down man. joke around. I mean, smiles and joking around, you know, making new memories. That's another big one. Like, um, bring, you know, you obviously have your phone with you. Most people have phones. Um, <laughs> and 50% of those people have iPhones. So I know the camera on those things are awesome because <laughs> I have them, right? So take some pictures, you know, that's another good thing you guys can do. You know, do a time lapse. That's, you know, make memories. John See, did a good time yeah, lapse. It was good. Yeah. It was well, I, I, I did like, you know, like two of them. Yeah, I know, pretty good. You know, another person did another one. So it was really, really cool. Now, you know, with, you know, doing like all that, you know, it kind of takes your, your, you're focused away from what you really should be doing because I'm worried about getting shots. I'm worried about getting content and stuff like that. But, I remind him. Don't worry. But I remind him. Later on, <laughs> you're going to be able to look back at that. And be like, oh, my God, this was awesome. I'm so glad I got this. Or, you, you know, you have those memories. And mm -hmm. those memories take you back, right? And then they make you happy. You think about the good times and what was going on there. And then and you can, that good stuff. at that point, when you do look at that, right, you, you can 
really visualize and plan, oh, I'm looking forward to the next time we get to do yeah. this, you yeah. know? Yeah. And it gives you something to look forward to, yeah. you know? Yeah. Like, oh, I can't wait to do this again. And, you know, I really enjoy my time with yeah. you. So it's nice. Goals, okay? Goals. Goals. That's couple goals. About. That's right, couple goals. That's us. Achieving those goals. <laughs> And always yeah. progressing on those goals, right? You always want to make things better. And so that's what it's about, you know. And some people out there, they, they take things for granted. We were talking about this the other night. Like, you know, like, you know, people start dating or after they're married and so long. And, then, you know, things just, they become routine, right? And you don't ever want that to happen. Don't let that happen. Um, and always be grateful for what you have because it can be gone in a second. Mm -hmm. So at that point... Live your life, have good times, and vacation. Okay, <laughs> it doesn't need to be some crazy. You guys don't have to vacation. go to Cabo. Literally, you can you can literally book a hotel down the street. That's right. At some whatever place. That's right. And you could you know it could be a minimal amount of money. Yep. And you just go by yourselves with yep. just you and your significant other. Day just, vacation, it weekend can, vacation. You know, I, it took, it's the little things. You know, t yeah. tonight I'm very excited. And the reason why I'm so excited is because movies are back, right? And me and John do movie night. And we have for years, right? Then COVID hit, movie shut down. And I, I lost my night with John. Like, my, my we didn't get a night anymore. Like, yes. sometimes I'd be like, oh, let's go to dinner. I miss my, my movie night with you. But still not, like, movie night, right? Because even at dinner, he might pull out his phone real quick. I'm like, we're at dinner, okay? And he's like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, in the movie, he's forced to put the phone away. You have to put it away and just enjoy that, that like, little warm feeling, yeah. you know, in the, in, the, in the seats. And then, you know, I buy an extra seat for my purse because so, I just don't want anybody sitting next to me, to be quite honest with you. But, um, you know, it's worth the six bucks, trust me. Yeah. <laughs> That's my child. Yeah, so, sure. But I'm excited. It's little things like that that you guys can do together that make a big difference in your relationship and that you guys can apply. And it may, trust me, it, it makes a world of a difference. And Absolutely. it could be the small little things. Absolutely. So that wraps it up for another Cupid's Corner Yay. every Sunday, 11 a.m. ABC. And if you didn't DVR it or you missed it, Make sure to check out YouTube, Titan Medical Center, type that bad boy in. You'll see all the shows and a lot of other cool content. Plus, check us out on Facebook and Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. So I'm John. I'm Sharice. And we'll see you next week with another Cupid's Corner. See ya.